Hello and welcome to Farming Simulator 17. I'm Andy and this is Shamrock Valley. <coughs> so uh, first off, thank you greatly to SP Farmer who suggested this first and Luke, Luke who also suggested this. So both of you, thank you a great deal for recommending this map. So, um, so we're gonna try it out, a little let's play, see how many episodes we do. So this is sort of the living room and then there's some computer room here. There's some other other people have done this better, more nicely. Look in here. We're gonna go ahead outside and look at the main farm which is here. Um we got this Massey Ferguson when we started out. I got the uh, attached to front load arms and got front loader tools there because we need a front loader. The idea I have with this map is to actually do some animal animal work so sorry uh, was close uh, I'm thinking cows which are over here oh, this is open close I don't know Maybe I can just go in there I don't know. um maybe it's here the cows are up there seems up there if you look at the map there's someone oh we'll figure it out when we get to that part i sold off a lot of my equipment so we do have let's see sold off a bunch of stuff with that like we had except i kept a massy and some tools and that sort of stuff but a lot of stuff we sold off but i do have gotten them these i got the this is a ford pack tw ford pack ford tw port pack sorry uh this is as you see tw35 which is our main tractor quite powerful so here are some tools too we got a mower and we got some weights and then we got a plow there don't remember if we have something in here we'll check that out no that's just empty um but anyway over here we have some more stuff i think we have do we have some tools in here this is the workshop by the way yeah, that's the workshop and then over here we have some tools and stuff of the tractor which is a tw15 gonna take that for a spin um those these tools were the rest of these tools were we had from the beginning um slurry pit uh, manure pit this is probably where you put the cows when you get those we've got a windrower and a tether so we can mow the grass and then we could get um, get some bales I'm done with that so basically and then we had the front loader to load it onto a trailer which we have down at the store so nice one we can open oh sorry it's gonna not do that we can open the door from the outside and yeah icy control N not a ton of stuff i think i like when you can turn on lights when it's dark Is that a mile? Can change the miles, kilometers? That's kind of cool. The side window we can open. Can open that window. Or the whole thing. And the window on the other side. So. <coughs> Let's take this for a little spin. So this is basically a main yard. I, this is two wheel drive. The other one over there is a four wheel drive, which will be our more heavy duty tractor. So here's the gate. There's an area up there which you can buy. And then we're pretty, pretty close to the store, which is just over here up at the head on the right. I'm going to go then grab our bale trailer which we bought I'm 
My idea, idea is to buy. Let's see, what am I going to buy? Uh, so SP Farmer suggested we get here's where you can sell tractors and stuff. SP Farmer suggested that we could maybe run some not old like old real old equipment, but more. I think this is the sort of equipment you were talking about. Hope I uh, hope I understood you correctly there. But this sort of tractors, not brand new, but not ancient either. So. Older equipment. I, I think this is like the 80s, early 90s maybe. So that sort of equipment, which I think it works pretty nicely. I like the fact this is an Irish map. It's like this is a hill and winding roads, and it's a hundred kilometers per hour. I always found that. I've been to Ireland a few times and driven in the. Um, I was going to say yard, but that's not a correct word. Driven around the countryside is the word I'm looking for. And it's, uh, it's, it's kind of funny to to see the, the speed limits, which are to me absurd, coming from Sweden. And even the Swedish speed limits are really, I mean, that not that slow compared to other countries. This is gonna work, maybe. I'm not the best of this backing up these sort of trailers. I guess if you do it slower enough, it should be possible. No, nope. that way. As I said, I'm not very good at these articulated trailers. If you do it slow enough, it should be doable. I hope. Maybe. I want to back it up to towards the side of the building there, but that seems to be a bit off there. Maybe I can live with that. Maybe I'm getting better at this. I don't know. No, nope. <laughs> sorry. Right. Maybe I'm not getting better at this at all, actually. So, we'll unhook that and we'll so take this forward. Um, so let's go and check the rest of the map out, I guess. So my idea is to actually rent um, a combine, because there are two fields that we can harvest, one and... What's that I feel? Um, so one, three, these two are ready for harvest, so we'll rent a combine and harvest these three. We also own 38, but that's cultivated. So six and seven are grass fields, which we can mow, which is the idea. We'll mow that, turn it into grass which we'll use for our cows or maybe or hay, maybe hay is better we'll tr mow and get hay and then we'll use that bale it and use it so I haven't set up um, as a course player, I haven't set up um, well what's the word I'm looking for sorry I'm a bit tired, long day I haven't. S I, sorry, I just lost it. Something I haven't set up something, which I can't remember. So this is basically one road leads down to the harbor, which is over here. Kind of sweet. I like this map. So link as always. Links are in the description. Um, hope you enjoy this. Let's play and hope you enjoy the map. Mostly, mostly for mostly. This is really beautiful area here, and scenery. Very sweet and nice here. 
it's a road train there i don't know train uh, railway i'm not sure you, there is a rail uh, train on this map but there's a road there anyway you could turn down on here i'm sorry that was bad driving oh sorry it's gonna take a shortcut Um, but the idea is to get starting, uh, firstly combining, and we get we'll get some a bit of grain which we can sell. We don't have since we sold a lot of our equipment and these tractors were kind of cheap. We have a lot of money, but we'll use that to buy animals. So, and to get to that part, we need also need a water trailer maybe yield. Yes. So up here is supposedly some sort of town, I guess. Somewhere. Oh yeah, uh, that, uh, that's fun. Here, here's the farm where we actually, our uh, Massey was at that point. So if we start out, your Massey, be, your Massey will be there. We'll go up and we'll take a hanger right here. Think around here, I guess. So it's not a humongous map, but it's kind of nice. I mean, nice scenery. And, and sort of, it feels Irish. I'm, I'm not a, I'm not a ton ad adverse. Is that a word? Adverse. I'm not a ton familiar with Irish countryside, but I've seen a bit of this Irish countryside, and this, this is sort of what I would. Ooh, sorry, There's a dog there, middle of the road. This is sort of what I would guess the Irish countryside might look like, or might look. It looks a little bit like the, my experience of the countryside, maybe with more pic picturesque villages. So, let's see. Uh, going here. <coughs> so I'm thinking I will try and get down to the harbor, see what that looks like, and then we're gonna head on back. And that's gonna be pretty much the extent of this first episode. And we'll leave it there. So this is not the fastest of tractors around. It's 30 kilometers max, which is, I mean, if you're gonna play that sort of older style, let's play a game, then this is what they would use. And this is the speed set. That's the way I grew up. I, when I grew up, I all, the only thing I knew about tractors was that they went 30 kilometers per hour maximum. So in this, the modern contact, uh, tractors does do a lot higher speeds, but still, this is not. So, here's actually a village. Let's see if it feels Irish. Okay, I think, I, yeah, I think uh, Shamrock Valley is Irish map. Is it, that's a flag somewhere. That's an Irish flag. Oh. What happened now? Why? Oh, yeah. Sorry. I forgot. If you look at the map here, there is a red line which shows you where you definitely where you can't drive. So you can't drive here into this town. We can get down, I guess, if we take this road here. We should be able to get up to should be able to get up to up to our up to our road there and get across to the harbor. Sorry, I forgot about that. I knew that. I, I just when I, when I hit it, hit the stop there, I was like, I wonder where it's stopping. And then when I looked at the map, it's like red line, red line, something with a red line. Yeah, yeah. I now I remember. So I think I watched. Uh, I think it was Dagawin who had a first look, sort of, ahead time on this of this map. Oh, well, that's by driving Anders. Anders. Uh, so and um, he definitely had a bit of. He looked around it and he talked about the red line. So when I suddenly when I looked at I saw the red line, I was like, yeah, that's right, that's true. Dagoin talked about that. So yes, here is some sort of trailer, like a caravan place. Um, camping site, I mean, camping site is where I'm looking for. Can I cut across? Yeah, I can cut across here. That's good. Save a little money. Not money, save a little time. A little roundabout here, and we should be able to get down to 
to the harbor. I think that's is here. Because you can continue on that road, I guess, but then you're stuck there. So here's a bunch of stuff. You have, I think, a cell point up ahead there. There's a silo where you can sell silage. Not silo. Like a BJ. Site safety. Cool place. I think. I think it's kind of cool. Anyway, it's a nice map. I, I like this map. It's it's not humongous. It's humongous. It's humongous is the word I'm looking for. It's nice. I guess it works. It's not working. Why am I doing wrong? I need something. Something is not working. Ah, it's really weird. I don't know. I, I have no idea. Why does IC doesn't work? I probably did something. I pressed some button or something to screw it up, I guess. So I think this is the livestock market, right? Oh, no. Now, now I realize what I did. Now I have a thing off. Um, I had the hide HUD uh, activated and then that means you sort of, well, is there something down there? I guess we could go down here, I don't know how we, yeah, maybe there's, there's a forest there, maybe we should go there. This is not a recommended way of reversing into a roundabout and driving on the wrong side of the road, again, but guess it works. Okay, so we'll go across here and then we'll go and we'll go through the forest. It's nice with forestry. Maybe we should get, we should, maybe we should get some, uh, like a, a trailer, like the crane trailer for the, the forest, forest with the lumber and like a chainsaw. That could be good, and good way to make money, maybe, or maybe not. I don't, I'm not sure. I will go across here and then head on back towards the farm. It's a nice scenery. I really like this scenery up over here. This this viewpoint across the harbor with the valley and the ocean there. It's kind of cool. So here's a bunch of field grass fields you could buy. Seems like a pretty much a good um, maybe a good sheep map if you want to do sheep. Um, I, I think I'll do some cows though. I like cows. And I think we should be able to get the cows the stuff they need. We need a trailer for the water. We mustn't forget to buy that. But we could buy the in-game one. Probably. You, let's see you and get up here. Uh, so today I had an inter interesting seminar at school. We talked about some laws and laws that govern certain things and and how you could force people to have, take help if they don't want help that's uh, but that's a, a rare not a rare occurrence if you work with it, it's not a rare occurrence but it's the laws in sweden are very much adapted and focused on volunteer vol voluntary sort of uh, um voluntary What's the word I'm work look I'm work looking for a special word um, voluntary Oh I can't find the words, sorry. T not task. It's nice and not the word I'm looking for. I'm looking for another word. Anyway, so here's the forest. So it looks nice. It's not a humongous forest, but it seems like a pretty okay forest. If you want to do forestry you could go down there probably. Onto one of the roads and, and follow that around. Is this this? Oh. Nice cabin. That's kind of cool cabin. With an axe there. And I like the fact that there's some tree stumps here around, lying around everywhere. It makes it more realistic, I guess. So number three, this field here. We own this one. And I'm going to get a, a 
combine and go harvest that. Maybe on the next episode. It's a pretty big field actually. It'll take a little while. Maybe I should rent a bigger har pretty big harvest. Ah, we'll see. Throw it there. So it's, uh, as you can see, it's a oh, decent sized road, but it's not a road map, sorry. It's a decent sized map. It's not humongous in any way, but yeah, I like it. So and this is by the way is by Oxygen David, who makes really cool maps. This is also something that seems pretty Irish, living in a, I don't know what you're gonna call those. Look like the ones you have uh, sort of at, like in you know, old cowboy movies. There's a church clock going off somewhere, so. And then up ahead we have a Tesco. So this is sort of, I think this is a city. It looks kind of nice, I like that. The sweet city. And here's a Tesco, our gas station, and then we're back at our, what do you call it? Yeah, I always point where we can buy stuff, our vehicle shop. I'm going to stop here because I'm going to go and get the... Uh, what's it called? I'm going to go and get the combine, which I'm going to use. But we'll do that next episode. This episode, we're going to go and first get out here. It's funny that it's like far away from... So that's about it. I'm going to stop there. So I'm Andy. This has been the first Let's Play on the Shamrock Valley map. And uh, if you like this channel, please subscribe. If you like this... God, what did I used to say? If you like this channel, please subscribe. If you like this episode, please hit the like button, leave a comment or share. And I will see you soon. Take care. I'm Andy. Bye-bye.